Fala gurizada, tudo certo galera? Voltamos com mais um episódio de The Elder Scrolls 5 Skyrim Modificação Enderal, galera. Nós estamos aqui cumprindo uma missão, acho que é uma side quest, galera, mas tá extremamente relacionada com a quest principal, beleza? A gente tem que falar com Ark Magister. Mega uma, exatamente onde a gente tá. Ele, ele, ele tá por ali, ó, beleza? Nunca tive aqui, na real. E essa é uma missão de duas estrelas, então ele possivelmente a gente vai ir em busca de alguma coisa, cara. Aqui a gente não, olha só, a gente não pode pegar nada porque tudo que a gente pegar aqui é roubar, né, ó. Então vamos lá falar com ele, deixar de bobagem. Para mim, meu amigo aqui parece ser o corpo de Crypt Corps. Well, ele não está. Você vê esse marco no seu forehead? Isso é o símbolo do Ashian. One of the two priest castes who reigned over the Pyrian Empire like the Lightborn did over Vin. He was no high priest, but more than an acolyte. Let's just hope he participated in the manufacture of the Siddle Stone back in the Pyrian era. Well, hoping can't hurt. But look, we have company. Belvarek, Archmagister, how's the situation? Walk blessed, Grandmaster. We're fine. Uh, everything is ready. So this is her? Yes. This is the prophetess. Hmm. Interesting. Truly interesting. I imagined you to be... different. I'm Lexiel Merigil, Archmagister of the Holy Order. Pleased to make your acquaintance. So, where do we start? Has the Grandmaster already informed you of the goal of this mission? Correct. Now you're wondering how will this be possible. This is where the word of the dead comes into play. An old relic we'll need to find. The word of the dead? I thought that was a legend. No, it exists. And we also know where. Just so you understand, the word of the dead is an artifact that allows entering a deceased person's mind to relive his last memories as if they were your own. And you want to do just that with our frozen pal here? This is the grand plan, right? Right. You'll need to locate the word of the dead Teleport the Pyrian's body to you, and then enter his thoughts. And there you'll have to look for the words of the ritual. Well, we only lack the last words of this ritual. What you have to look for is an ornamental scroll, which looks just like the one on the drawing I'll give you in a moment. All you have to do is remember the glyphs and the scroll, then write them down once you're back in the waking world. True, but we're talking about a different form of magic. It works similarly to the forbidden school of entropy. <sighs> You're telling me. I myself feel like a myriad in a toad's pond. But alternatively, we'd have to excavate every ruin on Vin and hope that some priest left one of the scrolls behind. That's right, but the priest himself did. And according to the legend, this should allow you to understand. Mm -hmm. Muito bem. Well, this is... There's an old manor in Andral's West that belongs to an old collector of artifacts. We received a tip that the word of the dead is in his possession. Hang on. Are you talking about this odd fellow with the puppets? The aged man from the folk song? I am. What? Mm-hmm. <laughs> You won't take it. It will be enough to find it. Use it on the Pyrian and then leave. You will travel to the manor with Dalvarek, wait for nightfall, and then introduce yourself to the aged man as a fellow collector of artifacts. Then you will offer him this brooch, and if all goes well, he will offer you a quarter for the night to negotiate in the morning. Then it's all a matter of timing. Sneak out of your room, look for the word of the dead, and teleport the Pyrian to you. A good question, but no. The aged man is special, so to speak. Even the Lightborn ordered us to let him live in peace. The Black Guardian knows why. So, if we have to trick him, we will at least do it inconspicuously, which is why you and the mercenary are well suited for the task. No one will connect your faces to the Holy Order. 
Then you'll flee. There must be no violence, no matter what happens. Archmagister? Yes, well, that is a good point. We don't know, because we don't even know what the artifact looks like. But how goes the thing? The proof of the eating is in the pudding. We'll manage somehow. And even if we don't, it definitely sounds like an adventure. It's a great responsibility, be aware of that. But I have faith in both of you. Now get going as soon as you can. This mission will be fruitful. I can feel it. Tudo bem, galera. And there they go. Yep, just meet me at the Myrids Tower at the Western Cliff. I'll go grab my stuff now. Ok, vamos ver o que a gente ganhou aqui no nosso inventário. A gente ganhou. Hum. Estamina regenera 10% mais rápido. Tá bom, é isso, galera. Nós temos que ir lá então. Um, 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 um. Onde que eu tenho que ir? Olha só, galera, onde a gente tem que ir, cara. Essa mira é do Western Cliff. Beleza, vamos voltar, vamos voltar. Eu já fiz a viagem até lá, galera, por isso que tá marcado. Eu fiz fazendo outras coisas, mas eu nunca cheguei naquela torre ali. Ah, tá aqui. Vamos voltar até o Marketplace, galera, pegar o, o Mirage, pegar uma carona né, nele até lá pra gente não perder muito tempo. E é isso, né, o que parece. Tá dizendo que é uma missão de duas estrelas, então não é tão difícil assim. A gente já fez algumas missões de três estrelas, galera, que são bastante difíceis aí pro nosso nível. Muito bem. Sim. Vou pegar essa partinha aqui que fica mais perto. E eu não gosto de viajar para lugares que eu não conhecia ainda. Né? Era, seria melhor ir a pé até lá, né? Mas para os nossos vídeos não ficarem tão longos assim, galera, eu resolvi adotar essa... Essa medida da gente ir Sim. usando o Mirad, beleza? Esquece, eu esqueci. Eu esqueci, galera. Eu esqueci, eu esqueci. Qual é o nome do lugar aqui? É. Western Cliff. Agora sim. Western Cliff. Aqui. Bora lá então. Vamos ver se essa missão vai ser muito longa, se ela não for muito longa a gente faz um vídeo só, se ela for muito longa a gente faz em dois vídeos, né? Mas eu acho que não vai ser tão longo assim. Muito bem, descobrimos o Western Cliff Discovered. E ali está o nosso parceiro. Não, aqui é o, é o Keeper, mas o Jesper está aqui atrás, olha só, escondido. Ah, there you are. Ready to go? <laughs> the scar. Well, let's put it this way. If you one day end up in a Talgalean tavern and two six foot tall Arazalean women invite you into their room, you should either damn well know who they are or make a run for it. Muito bem. Never heard of it? It's the capital of Araziel. At least if you ask the civilized people. Hands up. Guilty. Some rich snob had hired me back then to bring him a totem from one of the camps of the free people. That is, the Erezelians who worship their ancestors' gods, instead of the Lightborn and live as nomads. No idea how much you know about Eraziel, but the free people have been in conflict with the civilized people who do worship the Lightborn for centuries now. 
assassinations, blood feuds, and so on. The usual, if two sides both believe they know it all better. Anyway, obviously this job of mine originated from that feud. The totem belonged to a free tribe, and the snob wanted it in order to publicly defile it. So I got it for him. Oh, why, of course. I still cried myself to sleep months after that. <laughs> Seriously, why should I? Both the free and civilized are so eager to bash each other's heads in, it's not like one defiled totem more or less would have made any difference. <sighs> Correct. And I... I was a little drunk and a little lonely, if you get what I mean. Have you ever seen a pure-blooded Arazalean woman in her 20s? It's really hard to say no to that. In any case, as you already noticed, the whole thing went down differently than expected. My face made acquaintances with a table leg and four absolutely untender women's feet and hands. And of course the totem was gone, together with all my clothing and money. I guess I had that coming somehow. That's what happens if you ask your loins rather than your head in the wrong situations. Yeah. <laughs> oh, whoa, such a cold world this is. I present you my deepest scars, you thank me with naught but mockery. Be damned, oh impish creature. But anyway, how does the saying go? A truly beautiful face can never be tarnished. Facts remain facts. So much to do, so little time. <laughs> yeah, I did. Why do you ask? Now, aren't you inquisitive? Let me think. I spent most of my time abroad in Kira, and also a couple of years on the Isles of Kile. Uh, and there was this mission that led me to Maiar Aranath once. <laughs> what am I, a traveling tome? I'm afraid I'm not a very good storyteller. But uh, Kira's great. The people there are so much freer in their way of thinking. There are the great bazaars, uh, the palaces of the merchant lords, and the fortress of the mages' circles. Uh, but you just have to see it for yourself someday. Oof. Different. As beautiful as the Isles are, there's always this feeling of rush and competition. Have you ever heard of the game, Penny? On Kile, it's not a crime if a merchant tries to cheat a customer. It's the customer's fault if he doesn't see the fraud. But if he does, the merchant owes him a token penny. <laughs> Bizarre, isn't it? But over there, it's common practice. Ah, <laughs> well, I guess that depends on where you're standing. Of course, times can be tough, especially if you come to a new city or even country where you know nobody. But if you're good at what you do, which I am, there's always work, everywhere. And yeah, I don't eat God's tongue for breakfast, but it was always enough for a roof over my head when I wanted, and some other earthly pleasures. And that's what life's all about, isn't it? That's a good question. I suppose in the end, it was just a hunch I had. Plus, all these civil wars in other countries didn't exactly invite one to stay. <laughs> what? You mean the living dead, the watiers everywhere, the frenzied civilians? I'd say this country's seen better times. But at least something happens. It makes this place less boring. Wonderful. Me. Here, this is the place where the aged man's manor is supposed to be. Lead on. I'll follow you. Muito bem, galera. A gente tem que viajar até a mansão Long do West, homem friend. velho. Where are you headed? E... Mm -mm. Pois é, complicado. Still alive? Good. Let's go. We shouldn't waste any more time. Por que galera que eu fiz toda aquela conversa ali que não levou a lugar nenhum, cara? Enfim. Apenas curiosidade. 
série, ele fica marcando Blitz, dois pontos, cara. Você vai ter que esperar ele, velho. Ele tá se movendo, ele tá se movendo. Oh, Jesus, ele se trancou, galera. Na real, ele tá enfrentando um urso aqui. Galera, não vou gastar uma... uma flecha porque ele já tinha matado mesmo. Beleza, vambora. Será, galera? Nossa, mãe, cara. Exatamente, cara, essa mansão aqui que eu sempre tive curiosidade, galera. Olha só, velho. Tem que tomar cuidado, galera, essa região não é barbada não, hein. Eu não sei como é que tá o meu arco aqui, galera. Eu não sei se ele tá carregado. Ele tá carregado, sim. Que massa, velho. Que massa, galera. Que massa. Essas escadas aqui foram desenhadas pra serem colocadas no interior, né? Não no exterior, mas eles colocaram ainda assim. Hum... Ups. Eu vou chamar um amiguinho. Ah. Ai caramba. Eu não tô conseguindo, galera. Eu não tô conseguindo chamar o alimentar, né? Quem sabe, né? Eu não consigo. Lançar um Soul Trap nessa... Eu tentei. Ah, consegui. Vou deixar ele matar ali, azar. Aí pegamos mais uma soul aqui. Beleza, continuemos. Vocês puderam ver aí o né, o esses Whisper aí foram, sei lá como é que se chama, mas eles são bem fortes, porque eles mataram né, o meu lobo ali bem rápido. Olha que bizarro, cara. Temos aranhas aqui, galera. Eu as estou vendo ali, ó. Não pegamos nenhuma, nenhuma soul, cara. 
Não funciona a minha tática aqui. Que bizarro, cara. Tem uns caras congelados aqui, ó. Não, são uns caras de madeira. Eu tenho que cair até o entardecer, mano. Olha só, o cara apareceu na porta. Yes. What do you want? I'm the servant, so no, I'm not. And if you're looking for charity, you've come to the wrong place. Do you now? So what could two traveling merchants dressed in rags have that might be of interest to my master? Hmm. This is the silver brooch of a seraph. Where did you get this? Uh-huh. Well then, this changes the situation. You may enter. Plus, forgive my harshness. I... Misjudged you. Muito bem, galera, muito bem. Unfortunately, Master Gages is currently playing music and will be at least until dawn. But you can make yourself comfortable in the guest room. He will see to you in the morning. Okay, that sounds good. Today we wouldn't have made it back to Ark anyway. Just try to get Myrid Warden to fly in this weather. Hmm. So, a nice house you've got here. So it's just you and your master who live here, right? People talk about him a lot. Please, let's just save the small talk. You're here for business. Bom, galera, é o seguinte, eu vou ficando por aqui, beleza? Vamos concluir essa missão no próximo vídeo. Olha que bizarro, cara. Deixa eu virar o personagem um pouquinho pra cá. Olha só, velho. Beleza, então, galera, eu vou ficando por aqui. Deixa um like aí no vídeo, deixe seus comentários. No próximo episódio, vamos ver se a gente consegue concluir. Missão misteriosa, galera. Um lugar que eu sempre quis vir e não tive a oportunidade. Preparem-se, acho que vem coisa bem interessante por aí. Valeu, então, a gente se fala. Até mais.